level is somewhat common with brand new babies, so I don't want you to panic too much if the baby has a little bit of jaundice. But jaundice is when, during the sort of rush of blood to the baby in the minutes after birth, sometimes there's what's called an excess of bilirubin that builds up in the baby system from that. And newborns can have a little bit of a hard time processing this because their liver is slightly immature and that's what processes this is out. And what jaundice does in terms of the baby dealing with this is that it makes them sleepy and generally what's going to help flush the bilirubin out is breastfeeding. So you get a little bit of this catch-22 cycle that starts to happen. Sleepy baby, so feeds are not as effective, so jaundice isn't getting addressed, all right? Generally, your pediatrician is going to catch jaundice because you're seeing them fairly quickly um, after the birth. But if you had lethargy and if you had a baby that was starting to look kind of glowing, usually the first sign is you're looking at your baby and you're thinking, wow, they look so healthy. They're just kind of radiating and glowing. And then you start to realize that they're kind of actually orange. <laughs> but at first it can look like they're sort of glowing and healthy. And then you're realizing this glow actually has a little bit of an orangey jaundice tint, all right? Your pediatrician will do a blood test to assess what the bilirubin levels are and give you a plan based on that. Usually it's wake them up and feed them in order to help it process out. Repeat the blood test within tw after 24 hours. As long as the bilirubin levels have stayed the same or dropped, you're done, even though the kid is still orange. It's like considered no longer an issue. If the bilirubin levels had increased, the next stage of treatment after frequent feeding is full spectrum light therapy. So the baby would receive full spectrum light therapy, be placed under full spectrum lights with a little covering to protect their eyes. Um, or sometimes what is a nicer option is if, if the facility has what's called Billy blankets, which is when the lights are in a blanket. So you can wrap the baby with the light treatment and be holding the baby while the baby gets light treatment, okay? Um, and it rarely moves beyond that, okay? Uh, if for some bizarre reason it, it moved beyond uh, that level of treatment, then what would be the next stage is blood transfusion. In all my years of teaching, I've never had a baby who, who got to that place. <laughs>